Reuters, an Airbus operated by Lufthansa's German wings budget airline crashed into a mountainside in the French Alps on Tuesday, killing all 150 people on board including 16 schoolchildren. German Wings confirmed its flight for U9525 from Barcelona to Dusseldorf went down with 144 passengers and six crew on board. One of the plane's black box recorders has been found at the crash site, about 100 kilometers, 65 miles, north of the Riviera city of Nice, and will be examined immediately, France's interior minister said. In Washington, the White House said the crash did not appear to have been caused by a terrorist attack, while Lufthansa said it was working on the assumption that the tragedy had been an accident, adding that any other theory would be speculation. Aerial photographs showed smoldering wreckage and a piece of the fuselage with six windows strewn across the steep mountainside cut by ravines. We saw an aircraft that had literally been ripped apart, the bodies are in a state of destruction. There is not one intact piece of wing or fuselage, Bryce Robin, prosecutor for the city of Marseille, told Reuters after flying over the wreckage in a helicopter. German wings believed 67 Germans had been on the flight. Spain's deputy prime minister said 45 passengers had Spanish names. One Belgian was also aboard. Also among the victims were 16 children and two teachers from the Joseph Koenig Gymnasium High School in the town of Holtenamsee in northwest Germany, a spokeswoman said. Barcelona's Lyser Opera House said on Twitter that two singers, Kazakhstan-born Oleg Bryjak and German Maria Radna, had died while returning to Dusseldorf after they had performed in Wagner's Siegfried at the theatre. French police at the crash site about 2,000 meters, 6,000 feet, above sea level said no one had survived and it would take days to recover the bodies due to difficult terrain, snow and incoming storms. Police said search teams would stay overnight at altitude. We are still searching. It's unlikely any bodies will be airlifted until Wednesday, Regional Police Chief David Gaultier told Reuters. In Paris, Prime Minister Manuel Valls told Parliament, a helicopter managed to land, by the crash site, and has confirmed that unfortunately there were no survivors. It was the first crash of a large passenger jet on French soil since the Concorde disaster just outside Paris nearly 15 years ago. The A320 is a workhorse of aviation fleets and one of the world's most used passenger jets. It has a good safety record. However, according to data from the Aviation Safety Network, Tuesday's crash was the third most deadly involving an A320. In 2007 a Tamil Hazaria's A320 shot off a runway in Brazil, killing 187 people, while 162 people died when an Indonesian AirAsia jet went down in the Java Sea in December.